Say hi, guys. Hi. Hi. We're on to the next uh, little remodeling project here. The, so, there's a dog out here miserable in the heat, and Pete miserable that she had to leave Roblox, but no. she's out here. No. <laughs> but, uh, so, here's the garage, which is an absolute disaster area right now. But this entire section here, for some reason, where that pole is, all the way down, had a wall blocking everything. Uh, I decided to take it down, and it opened everything up, and now we have a giant pile of wood, so I'm going to make some other stuff with it. What we need to do right now... Hi, Lorna. <laughs> ...is take this massive toolbox which takes up half of the car and we're going to take it and put it over there on that table so we are clearing the way and then we will start cleaning to make this look good so hopefully by the end of the day we'll have a much prettier picture in here see you then got all of our crap out here Yes, it's beautiful with all the sheet rock lining the ground. <laughs> That's all ah, it's rock, it'll go. But slowly clearing it out. Got out all the shelves, dusted, swept. So, about time to bring this thing in. Okay, well, we've decided, well, I've decided that uh, I want to start showing a little bit of what we're doing. Maybe you have some memories of. Uh, us turning this house into a home after five years <laughs> but uh so i uh have kind of been making projects and that has been clearing out our woods over here and back although lauren has done most of it um we've been getting going on that um this part of our garage here as i've already said all had a wall for some reason blocking the two sides uh, right where that lolly beam is straight down the middle um, now it's completely open and all of this wood was used for the planks so we're going to take that and use it for other projects which is one reason why it still kind of looks uh, crappy in here not too bad though but we've cleared this up we've got the uh, washer and dryer all together uh, cleaned up again. We've got the lawnmowers in, although they won't stay in this position once I get everything cleaned. Got to get to Goodwill, but there's a pandemic going on, so we're not sure if they're open. But there's a door here that we want to get rid of. There's a chandelier we want to get rid of. Everything in this box can be moved, and we're going to put some shelving in right there. And that will take, and we will take all of the fuel cans over there, as well as all of our uh, bug sprays, windshield washer fluid, all that type of stuff and put right there so it's easy to get to. I have a weed whacker right here because I want to eventually put some J hooks in and hang it uh, vertical. Uh, that way it doesn't mess up the engine but hang it up so it's up out of the way. Same thing I'm going to do right here with the leaf blower. This was what we got today what i got today uh so new toolbox brand spanking new got all of my tools right here and here that i've got to fill it up with and make it all nice and then at some point in the near future i want to get rid of this table and put in an actual like workbench took down all the shelving that was behind it took down the shelving here made a bit of a mistake <laughs> and uh this cable uh, I thought went nowhere, but it goes upstairs to our room, bedroom, and then goes outside around to our living room. So I'm not sure if it's actually part of the uh, main cable line or not, and I didn't want to cut it out, so I'll have to fix that. But uh, got a few more things here I want to get rid of. Here's all of Lorna's uh, gardening stuff. And that should pretty much cover everything. So we're getting there. All this is open now. 
lawnmowers will be moved soon. Uh, should be able to clear it all up. And this is along with clearing out the woods and slowly starting to make uh, little home projects with all the wood that we've got. So uh, you can still see the sheetrock, but we cleaned up most of it. The rest of it will pretty much meld into the rest of the rock on the ground. Cleaned up uh, little, or Peeps Mini Cooper. She says she's going to use it. She's lying, but we'll give it to the old college try again. Other than that, we're looking good. You can see the woods out here. Again, all of this was covered in trees, large trees, and we've cleaned it out, cleared it up. I've got a pile of rocks here that were used for drainage. I got to put them, set them back up. But we're getting there. You can actually see all the way down in here. We've got a bunch of wood down there that we still need to light up and burn out. Uh, still some trash because of our the ex-owners. But all of this wood was just unable to be seen. You like you, it's just completely, you know, wooded. You could not use it. So here's Lorna's and her flowers, and our fire pit that is pretty much gone. So, oh yeah, and that uh, black spot on the fence is where about two years ago I was trying to light a fire with a can of gasoline, <laughs> and the can the fire decided to trail back up into the can in my hand, and I flung it, and that's where it landed. You know, so super smart. Anyway, that's where we are. Things are starting to come together here. Looks like we're uh, kind of getting ourselves together. Hopefully we'll still have jobs in six months and this won't make me uh, poor, but uh, we're getting there. All right, say bye, Lorna. <laughs>